Good morning, South Florida. I'm CBS4 meteorologist Lisette Gonzalez in weather control, and we are enjoying a mix of sun and clouds this morning. And we are seeing that view from our CBS4 camera in Doral. Some of the clouds, though, are starting to build. There have been a few showers, so take your umbrella. We're certainly not as sunny to start you off as yesterday, so hopefully you enjoyed some of that sunshine that we had yesterday. As we head throughout the day with the breeze out of the east southeast, some scattered showers possible, upper 70s in Broward Dade and through the Keys. And the disturbance near the Yucatan is not expected to develop in the next 24 to 48 hours due to wind shear and the fact that it is center over land. You can see the deepest convection is off to the east, so development really not anticipated for now. However, as it lifts northward into the Gulf of Mexico and a more favorable environment, there will be a 70% chance of this developing into a tropical or subtropical depression regardless of development, regardless of whether it even tracks just to our west, the center of it anyway. We can't focus on the center because all the deepest tropical moisture will be on the east side, on the dirty side if you will, of this system and you can see it will be right smack over us through the weekend. The European model is indicating that we could see rainfall totals ranging from 2 to 4 inches through Monday and yet the GFS is forecasting about four to eight inches of rain so how much rain we see all depends on how close it is to us however again there will be the potential for flooding the grounds already saturated since we've had plenty of rainfall the past week or so and really throughout the weekend you're going to want to stay tuned to CBS4 and plan on the fact that the rain chance will be very very high and we could see some gusty downpours and some flooding. For today, scattered showers warm and seamy, 86 degrees, boaters. Winds out of the southeast at 10 knots, seas 2 to 3. A light chop on the bays tonight. Lows will be in the low to mid 70s, muggy and mild with some showers. As we head into the weekend, the rain chance is increasing. And Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, are how wet our weekend is will depend on the disturbance and what happens with it in terms of the eventual track and intensity. But for now, we are giving you a heads up that it will likely be very soggy and unsettled at times and could be even windy. Also, it won't be a, a weekend to head to the beach as we're going to likely see a dangerous high risk of rip currents, rough surf too. So we'll keep you updated right here on CBSMiami.com.